In this video, we got a 250,000 MT pack opening for these new edition packs. You guys can see they include Dark Matter, Dwayne Wade, Galaxy Simple, Dennis Rodman. You can barely see their name, which is a little bit weird, but you also got Pink Diamond, Jonas Valanciunas, and you got the Diamond Jaden McDaniels, who looks to be a very, very good budget small forward. Could be a top five small forward in the game, or at least top 10, and going to be really good for his price tag. Obviously, though, the headliner is going to be the Dark Matter D Wade. I quickly want to see what the odds are looking like. So 13%, I believe that's for a Pink Diamond, 4% only for a Galaxy Simple. So it looks like they've gone down on the odds i'm not exactly sure how the odds were before but i believe that is a lot lower than what the odds normally are but let's just hop right into the pack opening here like i said we're gonna be spending 250,000 mt and seeing if we can pull maybe a galaxy Opal or a dark matter i mean obviously that d wade is gonna be probably a top three top five point guard in the game he doesn't really look to be that crazy as good as i thought he would be i mean he is only six foot four but which is not the problem with him but they're just point guards that are six foot eleven like ben simmons six foot nine like magic and his jump shot really isn't the best as we are going to get two uh, series pulls. I mean, we're probably just going to get a ton of these cards. We got Devin Booker once again. That's kind of crazy. I think we pulled him in our first pack as well. But hopefully, we can see at least a Pink Diamond, Jonas Valanciunas. I'm not sure they're even guaranteed. Like, so if you see a Galaxy Opal Shake, there's actually a chance you can get those, you know, Galaxy Opal Giannis or, or not, yeah, Galaxy Opal Giannis or the Galaxy Opal LeBron. So you're not even guaranteed to get that Robin. As we are finally going to see a Shake on the far left. It's not going to be a Dark Matter, which obviously not to be expected. Can we at least see a Diamond or a Pink Diamond pull? don't be an amethyst okay it's gonna be a diamond i mean this would be really cool if it's Jaden mcdaniels but like i said it could be a ton of other diamonds from the series set what is it gonna be western conference small forward is he a small forward power forward number three okay is that timberwolves i think that's him that's got to be him right that has got to be him okay we'll take that man Jaden mcdaniels he actually looks to be a very good small forward he actually might go for a little bit on the auction house as well once people realize how good of a card he really is so i would definitely take a look at Jaden mcdaniels and see if you guys want to add him to your squad because i think he's actually a very very good pull or i think he's actually a very good card that you guys can actually use on your squad like if you guys are trying to build you know somewhat of a budget team like he can actually be a very good card like i could see him going for 25 plus thousand mt if the odds are kind of low where diamonds are hard to pull which it looks like it's going to be so like the odds really aren't looking to be the best it is nice that these packs are only 10,000 mt you know per pack compared to like the 15,000. so at least they are a little bit cheaper but the odds definitely look to be cut in half we are going to get another shake on the far left and we're going to get an amethyst so there's no amethyst in these packs this will probably just be another series two class uh, card but let me know in the comment section down below what do you guys think about this new edition packs obviously they're a little bit confusing the way that i look at them is okay i'll, I'll explain it here quickly in a second because it's easier to explain when there's a visual on the screen but there's going to be four different you know we'll just say four different promo sets right so if i look at the cards in the pack you can see there's a card from signature series there's another card from signature series and then there's idols and then there's flash there's also going to be prime cards every single tuesday and basically from my observation i think there's going to be a total of four or five cards from each promo so eventually after the five tuesdays in season five there'll be five flash forward or flash cards there'll be five idols there'll be five signature series and then five prime cards that are all going to lock in for a dark matter player because that's what they tweeted out on their twitter so i feel like Dwayne wade is not obviously a lock-in but he'll go towards a lock-in so that means the next you know signature series cards are probably only going to be diamond pink diamond and amethyst if they even go low as Amethyst. So probably should be Diamond and a Pink Diamond because they already have a Galaxy Simple Signature Series in Dennis Rodman and they already have the Dark Matter in Dwayne Wade. So if you guys are a little bit confused on it, definitely don't be worried because it's confusing. Like I might not even be right, but that's just my observation. At least what I think it's going to be is we are going to get a Pink Diamond. Can't get too excited because hopefully this is uh, Jonas Valanciunas, but there's a chance this could be some random Series 2 Pink Diamond and it looks like that's not going to be JV Eastern Conference. I know maybe it is. Yeah, center number 17. Yeah, I know that's JV. I'm a Raptors fan. I love this guy when he was on the Raptor. Sad he got traded for Marc Gasol, but... Oh, a hollow. Okay, that is actually nice. He should be a very fun card to use. Definitely will be getting a gameplay on him later today. So if you guys want to stick around, turn on post notifications. I'll get you guys gameplays on Jaden McDaniels, Valanciunas, and then hopefully, you know, we, if, we, if we could pull a Robin or a Dwayne Wade, obviously we'll definitely be getting gameplays on those cards as well as we are going to see another Devin Booker. But like I was saying, kind of explaining the whole promo set and how it's going to work. That's at least in my opinion from what they've posted on Twitter and what people have speculated is we are going to see a Dark Matter. Oh my Lord. Oh my Lord. We are going to see a Dark Matter and that has got to be Dwayne Wade holy crap I did, I did not mean to click on the amethyst there oh my lord guys we just pulled dark matter Dwayne Wade I'm 99% sure yeah because like the, yeah there's no other dark matters the T-Mac I mean I would love a T-Mac or d -Rob over D-Wade but man oh man we will take that holy so definitely be getting a gameplay and a mode coming later today dark matter glow man all oh, that dark matter glow is so oh man it's so I don't know 
Man, I love the Dark Matter glow. Holy. As we are going to see Dark Matter, Dwayne Wade, Eastern Conference, Shooting Guard. You know the number. Number three from the Miami Heat. 99 overall. Could it be a hollow? That would be sick. Okay, no hollow, but definitely can't complain, man. Shooting Guard, Point Guard, Dark Matter, Dwayne Wade. Look how sexy that car looks. Man, that is such a good pull. Definitely will be getting a gameplay on him later today. And we still got 150,000 MT left in the pack opening. So there's a good chance we can maybe see a Dennis Rodman. That would obviously be a sick pull. But leave a like, man, for that Dark Matter pull. What a crazy, crazy pull from these new edition cards. But like I was explaining, there's going to be those five or four new cards from each promo set. And then at the end of the season, I do believe there'll be a Dark Matter lock-in. Can we get a Galaxy Opal? As we are going to see another Diamond. I mean, I'll take another Jaden McDaniels. Like I said, I believe he could actually have some good value. And I'm pretty sure... That's going to be another Diamond Jaden McDaniels. I mean, he doesn't really look to be that rare or doesn't look to be that common to pull. Obviously, he'll be somewhat cheap because he is a Diamond card, especially at first. I think he'll go down in price, but... I think once people realize how good of a card he really is, I could definitely see him going back up in price to maybe like 25, 30,000 MT or just maybe like, a you know, 10 to 15,000 MT more than he's going for right now. As we are going to get another pink diamond, could this be another Valanciunas? I mean, I'll definitely take duplicates, you know, from the cards in the set. That is going to be, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's going to be uh, Jonas, uh, Jonas Valanciunas. But guys, let me know in the comment section down below if you guys are going to be ripping these new new edition packs. Let me know what you guys pull and let me know what you guys think about the promo drop as well. So we're going to get a hollow Valanciunas and a normal one as well we'll definitely take that and obviously send them to our auction house we are going to see a shake down the middle what is it going to be can we see a galaxy opal and is oh that's a guy that's a galaxy opal holy i thought there was a diamond at first i scrolled over i thought that was a diamond please be dennis rodman that's going to be rodman we pulled the entire set we legit just pulled the entire set and i think around 200,000 mt are these odds boosted or something? Because there's no way I just pulled the entire set, but we will definitely take that, man. Gameplay is coming out on every single card. That is a sick pack opening. I'm not going to lie. I mean, I don't think I've ever pulled the entire set. I guess I'll rip a couple more packs. I don't think I'm going to do the all 250,000 MT because we literally just pulled every single card in the set. So I'm going to do two more packs here and, and spend about 200,000 MT. I mean, that is a crazy pack opening. Man, you guys got to leave a like for that. That is the craziest thing. I don't think I've ever in my My Team history ever pulled the entire set. I know it's only four cards but to pull a dark matter opal pink diamond and diamond and only 200,000 mt i don't know man i think that's pretty crazy but we're gonna end here on in sapphire uh desmond bane card but man that was a crazy pack opening hopefully you guys did enjoy and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace